Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to Interstage Window, my Saturday stream where we have um, a conversation with friends. And today we're doing one of those things with our community day. We have Landon and Kitty here with us. Say hi, guys. Hello. Hi, guys. Hi. Welcome, 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 everybody. Kendra, I see you in the chat. You're welcome to join us. I know like you're still dealing with stuff, but if you'd like to join us, you can. Um, and, uh, and, and Landon, tell everybody what we're going to be doing today. What are we doing for our community day today? We're going to play some Stardew Valley. <laughs> I don't know why I sang it, but it felt necessary. <laughs> no, that feels right. That does feel right for Stardew. So if you mm -hmm. are a viewer and you would like to join, what you need to do is get in our Discord server, exclamation Discord right there. You need to have the farmer role. That will give you everything you need to know about joining us on Stardew Valley. Um, and I just realized I, because I, I started this stream with the wrong tags and everything, I didn't put playing with viewers on here, which is true. We were playing with viewers. So there we go. It's fixed now. <laughs> All right, you guys. Um, I'm going to launch the farm. Feel free to chit chat while I get that going. And I will post the code for the, uh, the down on the farm in both Discord and in the Twitch chat. Kendra said that she is going to be here just a couple minutes late because her computer turned off. Oh, fun. It's Love a Saturday it. morning for computers, too. Nobody else wants to wake up as well. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> rude, oh rude computer. Okay, where's my thing? I always remember. We only, I only do this on stream. There we go. Um, we got to copy the invite code. Okay, there it is in the Twitch chat. I'm going to write it in the Discord as well for you guys because I assume that y'all on the call don't have the Twitch chat. I I wonder if this is the same code every time. You know, I don't really pay attention, but it kind of looks familiar-ish. But it's been a minute. I so also it, feel like if you get random letters together, like it always just looks familiar when it's random letters. Your brain is just like, it's another combination of random things. Oh my gosh, maybe that's true. <laughs> maybe that's why I feel that way. Maybe that's why I feel that way. And I apologize to everybody, my voice is still jacked up. It is better than Thursday, but I'm realizing as I'm talking into the microphone, it probably sounds like the same to you guys. Um, <laughs> it probably still sounds just as jacked up as it did on Thursday. It sounds nice. Well, you you sound do? Oh, good. Yeah. In my head, it sounds like super jacked up. All right, so we're unpaused. There's the code. Y'all can join. Come join the farm. And I decided I'm going to try to catch some of the fish that we still need to catch for the summer. We need a puffer fish and a sturgeon fish, which we can get in the summer still. So I'm going to try to do that um, for the community center. Katie's I in. I yes, Landon, I saw your I think name. you have a package. Oh. I have a package? Mm-hmm. What? I'm I think it's either you or Kendra has an unopened package in one of the cabins. Oh, oh. Landon has mail. Let's see. I, for whatever reason, this invite code is not working. So Did I type it wrong? I might have typed it wrong. Um, the one in the Twitch works. Okay, yeah, because I copy and pasted that, but I can't copy and paste it into the Discord on my phone. So let me try again. If I have to open the chat, I can do that as well. Or open the uh, Twitch, I can. Okay, I tried it again. I don't think, I think I, it looks like I did it right the first time, but if I, if I did it wrong, then I just did it wrong again. So I don't know, I don't know. Because <laughs> Discord takes up too much bandwidth and I, I don't know what y'all do when y'all join me. There we go, these, maybe there was a space or something at the end of the chat. Oh yeah, maybe. <clears throat> None of us have an upgraded axe, is that right? Um, I let's see what I have. No, I have a copper axe. Okay. See if I can remember how to play this. <laughs> it's Landon. That is all. Kendra! <gasps> Kendra Hi. stream return! Kendra stream return! <laughs> how are They're you feeling, see. girl? Uh, we're gonna see. The second I said, yeah, I'm really good enough to stream, I got sick again. Of course. Oh, so of course. We're gonna see. But, that karma uh, gotcha. 
Yep. It was like, oh, ho, ho, you think you're done throwing up? Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> you thought, bitch. Yeah. That's what it said. Basically. All right. Do I not have shoes on? Does my I farmer not have cool. shoes? No, I have shoes. Okay. <laughs> Are they just flesh colored or something? No, I just went to check the shoes in my cabin, and, or the oh. chest in my cabin, and there were shoes. And I was like, wait a minute, hold on. This doesn't feel right. I, I feel like that. that's more farmery. What, to not have shoes? Yeah. Just be one with me. I feel like it's actually the opposite. Farmers need shoes. <laughs> yes. It is very much the opposite. Well, I don't live in a farm. <laughs> well, I guess, I guess so. I guess so. Sure. Listen. Okay. Um, so we are trying to get the sturgeon and stuff like that. Is there anything else that we're trying to do today? Um. Yeah, I was gonna try to fish for those last two fish. There's definitely still like plenty of um like geodes and things we can get. We probably need to actually buy a barn um so we can have cows because we need milk. We um, have a barn. Oh, we have a barn. Do we have any? Do we have we bought a cow yet? I don't think we bought a cow. I think we I need to buy, buy a cow. cow. I'll go buy yeah, a cow. go buy a cow. Get us a nice cow, Landon. Give it a be beautiful name. Well, since you insist, <laughs> rude, exotic. Fort. It'll be named Persephone. Oh my Ooh, goodness! I love it. Oh, there's a Pokemon in the chat. There's a Pokemon in the chat. What? Yeah. Yes. Cross, I cross games. I installed a new chat game um, in the Twitch chat. So uh, you have to have the Twitch chat open to do it. And it's like pokey, exclamation pokey start to get it started. But um, it's uh, once you get it started, you can do exclamation pokey catch. Oh, exclamation pokey catch, kitty, not just catch. Um, and then uh, and you can play. Got you. That's it's, exciting. It's Tuesday. Uh, Marnie closed. No. Rip. Tomorrow I, then. I just, just been all day microwaving. But I just spoke to my favorite person, so. Well, well, who's your favorite person? Leah, of course. Oh yeah, Yay. yeah, that's true. You love Leah. Red redheaded lesbian. Come on. She is. Yeah. Yeah, we've got to go for for the redheaded lesbians. Okay. We have like no choice there. That's one hundred percent true. All right, I, I completed some more me. bundles out of stuff that we had in the chests. Okay. Now I head into the beach to try to catch a puffer fish because they spawn in the afternoon. No, yeah. no one caught the cacturn. Oh well. Oh well. That's okay. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna try to earn money. Yeah, that's I'm over we here like need okay. Money. Gotta oh, yeah. gotta gotta get the the folding money. Mm -hmm. Bailey. Hello. Ew, you're all dirty. Okay. <laughs> hey, we don't <laughs> like dirt. I mean, listen, that's I can understand. You know, farms have a specific smell. That's and true. The farmer is not the type of person to um shower. <laughs> well, that's not true. Speak for yourself. <laughs> we don't have a bathroom. Oh shit, that's true. There is no bathroom in the Stardew Valley house. We okay, need to turn well, one of the cabins into a bathroom. That's awkward. Yeah, mm -hmm. or do we just, like, jump in the river with Linus? Like, that's fine. But I would like to see that cutscene. Mm -hmm. I'm sure someone's modded it. I bet, wow. Well, that sounds like, like if we're gonna, Valley Peeps would do. If it's gonna happen, it's probably Sebastian on the beach. And mm. sort of like, you have to be free! <laughs> one with nature. <laughs> yeah, but the beach is salty. You've got to you've got to ba bathe in that fresh water. Salt water is good for your hair, though, uh, and and your skin. 
Mm -hmm. Is that true? Yeah. Makes it super soft. Oh. I mean, I knew that. I know that's true from swimming at the beach, but I wasn't sure if that was like a good thing. Or if that was just. You wasn't a sure if your hair being super soft was a good thing. Well, I don't know if it's like healthy for it. Oh, okay. Maybe <laughs> it's like. I know, now hold on. I know it makes your skin and hair feel cool, but. I mean, we're here for a short time, not a long time. <laughs> Oh, apparently, so, we, somebody's... I've got a steel pickaxe upgrading. So we'll have a, a steel pickaxe soon. Kay, welcome in, welcome in. Kay, if you would like to join, you know what to do. I've given you the instructions before. Yeah, Willie, I'm in your exciting. spot. I guess I'll scoot over. <laughs> Rude Whatever, I'll go fish next to Landon. Oh, you're not a Stardew fan. Okay, I don't, I don't understand, but I, I guess I respect it. <laughs> There's so many aspects to it that, to enjoy, though. Exactly. That's why I like Stardew. There's just so much to do. So much there to do is. with Stardew. Without pressure. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, Kendra, I know that you got sick again, but, like, I guess you're feeling okay today? I'm feeling okay today. It just, you know, it comes and goes in waves. Okay. So you're kind of just taking it one day at a time right now? Yeah, I'm taking it one hour at a time right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I'll be oh, I got totally a super fine kicker. for a long time, and then all of a sudden it's just, oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. I'm so sorry. Yeah, you know what? It's the miracle of life. Yeah. <laughs> if one more person says that to me, I might um, wind up in jail. <laughs> it's a miracle of shut up! I didn't yes. ask for this! Well, it, it, exactly. And also, most people don't suffer like this. Why yeah. does it. Why me? <clears throat> I'm a good person. I don't deserve this. Maybe there'll be longer breaks in between now? I, I, you know, who knows? I just, it, it, it what, like, I can't do anything about it. Okay. Yeah. No, puff, no puffer fish today. I filled up my inventory. I tried. Rip. Yeah, sad. I should have emptied my inventory before coming out here, but I was being lazy, so I didn't. Well, we're also so used to having the big inventory spaces mm -hmm. yep that is why we need money we all need to get the max inventory upgrades and upgrade all of our tools yes desperately yes that will be a big okay. help okay you talk about arc but it's first person so you know i can't play arc rip sorry go ahead landon i cut you off i said we forgot to let the chickens out oh no no oh, they've been out it should so automatically come out. The doors close automatically at night. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. They come out. Yeah, I have, a mod that, I have a mod that automatically opens and closes the doors. Sure. I keep forgetting it's not the same in a co-op, and I take the trail to get home and end up in the wrong house. Oh, oops. <laughs> there. It's okay. We all share cabins. Yeah, it's that's the joys of... <laughs> of the co-op experience. <laughs> okay, I don't think I don't think I need any of these fish. I can think I can sell all of them. I went to play co-op with my husband the first time and I jumped into his cabin and he was like, "What are you doing? <laughs> Why are you You didn't in? know. Are... Why? I mean, he was just like not not creeped out, not grossed out, but it was that sort of like this is not what you do. <laughs> this is what this is how this is what we do, sir. I'm like, excuse me, we're married. Mm -hmm. Like, come on. The only person doesn't that doesn't know. belong in the bed is when the dogs used to stop me from being able to get into the bed. That made me mad. Oh my god, I love. Yes. I was so happy when they fixed that and made that so that wasn't a thing that happened anymore because it drove me in fucking sane. I didn't know they fixed it. That's exciting. I, I mean, yeah, I haven't had that happen in a long time in any of my farms. Mayor Lewis doesn't belong in the bed, but 
<laughs> I, unless you're Marnie. Even if you're Marnie, like, come on, <laughs> sweetie. Come on. You can do better. She could do better. Could do better. My steel pickaxe is ready. Yay. He's a tea drinker, though, so he has some points. So you want to hear the horrible thing that happened to me last week? Yes. yes. We're all having stress week, so I think we wanted to hear all of that. Yep. Um, so my son is a thrill seeker, and he was playing outside, and I let him climb the trees. He only climbs a couple of branches, and that's fine, but he decided he wanted to climb all the way to the top, and I went out to like, hey, where are you? Where, where are you? Yeah. And he was like, I'm up here. And he had climbed like two, three stories high and couldn't get back down. So I had to call the fire department. Oh no. <laughs> your your son literally got stuck up like a cat. What in the heck? Yes. Yeah. Oh uh, what? Oh. <laughs> uh, Fortunately he oh, knew to hold tight. So I, I was actually really worried at the time because I was like, if he falls he's gonna hit every branch and it's a really long drop. Yeah. Um, but he was fine, so oh, it's good. a good okay. laugh now. <laughs> that is too well. funny. <laughs> and um, then when he got down, um, they were like, so you know never to do that again, right? He was like, oh no, I'm definitely doing that again. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> and they were like, uh, so we need you to trim your pine trees up so that he can't access the branches. Oh. So I was like, Okay, I agree. I definitely think for, you know, safety reasons, that's what I got to do. Unfortunately, my pine trees are covered in poison ivy. Uh-huh. And I thought I was being safe about it. I had the long pants and the socks, but um, they have prickles oh. on them that can get through your clothes. Yep. And oh. I got covered in head-to-toe poison ivy rash. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Um, so I'm sorry I I'm laughing, but it's, <laughs> it's okay. Very, it's okay. It just sounds like a sitcom. Um, so they put me on really strong steroidal antibiotics, which are a hoot to take. Uh, yeah. And I get to play a fun game. This is, I mean, it's an adult show, so I'll just say it. This is a fun game I get to play where I get to guess if the poison ivy has spread to unmentionable places or if the antibiotics oh, no. are just... <laughs> Yeah, oh, horrible. No. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds terrible. But All my right. yard looks great. <clears throat> cow has been purchased. Yes. Yay. Oh, did you also purchase cow? Oh, it was my job. It's okay, we can have two cows. We can have two cows. We it's need okay, the milk anyway. Yeah, we need milk and we need large milk, so we can have two cows. And we got to make sure that we milk the cows um, every, every day. So yeah. whoever wants to handle the cow milking. Okay, so I have a steel pickaxe now. Um, did somebody want it? I know somebody was asking, and I just put my regular axe in to upgrade to steel. Um, I was asking about the axe because we need um, the, I can't remember what it's called, the, the mushroom. woods. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And well, be it'll nice. be upgraded in a couple days. So we will have it some at some point. Mm. Do we have any bait mm. in any of these chests or should I just, I should just buy bait, I think. I probably yes and is someone watering and harvesting melons because we still need one more gold melon yes i'm watering and harvesting them okay fabulous We're so close yep at least the fall one is corn and we already have some gold corn from since we can grow that in the summer yeah so that one's easier it's helpful oh hello ma'am yes all right, I got a lucky day today, so maybe I can get a puffer fish. Fingers Ooh. crossed. You just zoomed right past me. What? I did. <laughs> you were, you were busy. Hello, my friend. Yes. 
You look you looked busy with Leia, so I was. I was presenting her with flowers. <laughs> Isn't that how you asked for a date? Um, uh, not those. No flowers. other. Okay. No, she did a sweet pea. Yeah, she's not trying to date Leia. No, not right now. I haven't made time for Harvey, so I just made time for Harvey. Did you get hurt? No, he's up by the fountain. <laughs> Wait a so. second. You're flirting with Harvey? <laughs> <laughs> not flirting. I'm just talking to everybody. Uh oh, competition. It's fine. Give me sister wives. That's fine with me. I know there's a mod where you can like date and marry multiples of the um, villagers, but is there a mod that's the other way around? Do y'all know where it's like, you know, the they can marry multiple of us farmers in a co-op? It would be nice because I don't know. I like options. Yeah, uh, and Stardew has options, but not that many options. I just think that would be neat. Oh, excuse me. Bless you. Bless you. Thank you. So if you make mods and you're listening, that's what the people want. Yeah, yeah it'd be a really up. cool mod. I don't know, it might already exist. I have no idea. I... I never looked into it. Who knows? Oh, Bob. Oh, my nose. A puffer fish. Yay. Okay. Yay. You did it. Did it. We still need a sturgeon. Um, that's up by the lake, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I can go there. Yeah, 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 yeah. The pufferfish was the one I was worried about because he doesn't spawn later. The sturgeon spawns in the summer and in the winter, I think. I think when we kill a certain number of monsters, we get special items too. I'm not sure if it works in co-op, but that would be nice. Oh. I wonder in co-op if it's like a collective or what exactly it's probably the same as like oh reach the bottom you need to get there you have to go visit it yourself yeah but it unlocks like one only one person is needed to unlock it but like you still have to go there oh it's in specialty fish okay well i know what the museum each person gets to collect yes we have discovered that so everybody gets each prize I wasn't watching chat. There's a Pokemon. Oh my it, goodness. It's been 90 seconds yet, though. If it hasn't told you, then probably not. Yeah, I feel I like it's it very good about it. telling you. Yeah. I caught it. Yay! Yay. Yay. Which one did you get? <clears throat> it's a Fletchender. I think that's how you say that one. It's a little bird Pokemon. Ooh. Get it. No, oh, that cow just ran. Oh, it's five. Okay. I'm trying to figure out why is the cow running? <laughs> is that what places threatened to be, Kendra? the cow? What? Places to be. Yeah, well, listen. Um, I don't care how many places to be you have. We don't run in this house. <laughs> okay, let me just Google when this when this sturgeon comes up. What time of day? Because I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> There's too many fish to remember. There is. Okay. Sturgeon is in the mountain lake in summer and winter from 6 a.m. to 7 p.m. So I've got one more hour today. Then we can try I'll again tomorrow. Out. Thank you. Whee. I hear someone else too, but I don't see them. I'm over by the mine fishing. Oh, okay. Sweet. Man, I, sorry, I'm just like, zoning out at the screen like, ah, yes, a video <laughs> game. Oh, Stardew the computer. Is, Stardew is so good to do that, too. I don't think I've gotten a, a computer for, like, four months. Yeah, because you were having Aww. such bad, like, every time you sat down, it was nausea, right? Yeah, well, I couldn't sit up for more than an hour. Yeah, I know that um that I was seeing you a lot, like, coming into the streams, but then just, like, 
not saying anything, <laughs> just like lurking. I was like, oh no, yeah. poor Kendra. <laughs> it's that, and a lot of times, Eliza will want something from me, which mm. is fine. But if I can't get her to sit and watch something during stream time, it's like, well, <laughs> rip. Well, soon she's going to have a little sibling, and then yeah. she can be entertained by that. You can give her chores to help the sibling. You know, what I was thinking, because my weeks switch over on Friday, I'm not even halfway there. Oh, Re oh really? And I'm just sitting here going, why? I'm not <clears throat> even halfway there yet. Do you have a little oh. bump? Oh, yeah, I have bump. Oh, sorry, I just picked up all that wood. I did not mean to. Oh, it's fine. I was getting it for the chests. Well, I'll go put it in the chest after yeah, I sell. Yeah, like, whatever. <clears throat> it, I'm just trying to be productive. Yes. And maintaining space. No, no I'm only I'm only at 18. I'm like, why? <clears throat> why? So close to halfway. Poor Matthew. It feels Poor like, Matthew. but it feels like it's been like so much longer. I guess because I knew really early on, and that's not typically how things go. Yeah. It, even <clears> then, <throat> it feels like it's been longer because so much of the normal routine has gotten disrupted. Mm hmm. In such an awful way. <laughs> The time does not go fast. I understand, yeah. But it's okay. Feeling feeling a little better. I, you know, power read all the Bridgerton books in like a couple days. Oh. Are the books any good? I know people are obsessed with the show. Um, so one thing that becomes very clear, very um quickly if you read them back to back to back like i did was that the author has a thing for for nipples oh <laughs> um and it's like and the climax of every romantic confession centers around nipples okay <laughs> and it just got really weird really quick <clears throat> because i was reading them like one after the other Within the span of a few days. Fascinating. Um, Did it change your mind on how important nipples are? Um, no, it actually, because one of my pregnancy symptoms is very painful uh, body parts. Um, it, it hurt me inside a little bit. I was like, absolutely not. Do not mention the forbidden body part. I don't want to think about it. <laughs> hey. Don't. Do not. Um, like, nipples are fine, but, like, a strong gust of wind right now just sends me to my knees. I'm like, please stop. Please. So I'm was, trying so to get to not, bed. not pleasant for you. No. No, it's uh, very painful. Um, um getting, getting dressed, dressed is, is painful. painful. I don't, I don't recommend, recommend pregnancy. pregnancy. It's not, it's not great, great, guys. guys. Well, you're gonna you're gonna be okay when the kid comes out, though. Yeah, you're gonna be like, okay. that's, that's, that's that's the thing. thing. It's, it's like this is it's great. great. I, I love, love what happens, happens afterwards. afterwards. I, don't I don't like, like what, what happens, happens to my body. To my body. It's, it's a crawl. crawl. It is a smog. Um, uh, up late. Who's staying up late? I, it's, 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 it's me. me. I, I, I got, got sluggish, and so I had to walk from the mine to the sluggish mode. I felt so sad. Rip. Funny. And in, and the, in grass, the grass, you're even, even slower. slower so I'm, I'm like, <laughs> and we got a lot of grass. <laughs> we do. We need, we need another, another Milo. Milo. It's painful. It's painful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, somebody feel free to go um, buy and build another silo if y'all want to. That's fine. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. I did, I did. You, you made, made it. it. I'm so proud. Yay. <laughs> uh, I, will I will say, say that the changes, changes the show did, did um, um, I, think I think takes, takes away a lot of the... Uh, uh, magical, magical romance, romance mm. that the, the books, books have. have. So the books are not trying to be realistic in regards to the way they do their romance. Is that what you're saying? No, no, no. It, it, um, 
I, I, I think, think that, that there's, there's more, more connection, connection and, there's and there's more chemistry, chemistry between, between all, all the characters, characters in the in books. The books. Mm. Uh, especially, especially with, with especially, especially with the newest, newest season. season. Oh, I, I love the newest of, 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 of show. show. So, so it's a huge reason why I'm not reading, reading the book because, because I, don't I don't want it, want it to be like, like ruined. ruined. It, it was so, so hard. hard. I, had I had to sit, sit and, and wait, wait and, and like, like I got, I got all, the all the spoilers. spoilers. I was like, like that's not, not even. even. It's, it's a very, very similar, similar thing, thing to you know people with. Uh, uh, the, the Witcher, Witcher or, or with Game, Game of, of Thrones, Thrones or other, or other books, books where it's like, like these characters, characters yeah, they, they share, share the same name, name but, <coughs> but they're not the same character. They're, they're making, making or not. not. Mm-hmm. No. Yeah, yeah I, like, like I said, I, said, I haven't read, read the books, but I've read, read a lot about, about them, them, and I, I actually think, think I'm, I'm... I don't think I will be in the book series, but I haven't read it yet. I... Really enjoy um, the, the way, way that, that because, because they switch, switch point, point of views from, from what, what the, the male, the male interest, interest to female, female interest. interest. I really, I really like, like how you get, get more, more of a sense, sense of, the of the characters as a person. As a person. Mm. Um, um, one, one of the, the key, key things, things my Viscount who loves me is the uh contrast of how what Anthony thinks of himself to be versus what he actually is. Oh. And it's so funny in the books because he's like, I'm a bad guy. I'm you know, this naughty boy. And the whole time he's just like, let me hear. Let, let's, you know, increase your sister's dowry. We've we've got the money. Let's do it. And she being so kind and gentle to everybody he meets at all times. <laughs> While sitting here going, I'm such a terrible, I'm, I'm, I'm such a bad, bad man. Nobody, nobody would ever want me. I'm a bad, bad man. It's so, oh. it's so funny. Because you're sitting there going, you are not Fonzie. I know you want to be Fonzie, but you're not Fonzie. Well, I thought it was like self-loathing. <laughs> No, no, no. He was like, I'm a cool guy with like oh. shades. Like, I'm a but he's cool, like a bad boy. Naughty boy. I'm a bad boy. I'm naughty. And I he's you... so not. He I just was like Dobby. No, no, no. He's... <laughs> he wants to be like the sexy bad boy. And he thinks he could be the sexy bad boy. And he is so wrong. <laughs> Uh, I hate to do this, y'all, but I gotta go. I'm not feeling too well, so I'm gonna. I'm oh gonna no! Listen. That's okay, Landon. I hope you feel you better. Go rest. All right. Uh, have you. a great rest of stream. Um, and I'll talk to you guys soon. All right. Talk to you later. Okay. Bye. 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 So I know Landon is off on Monday for the holiday. Um, That'll are, be good. are you guys are you guys having a Monday holiday too? I am. Off on Mondays generally. Yeah, so it's yeah. normal Monday for you. So it's normal Monday. That's his weekend. Is Monday, Tuesday. Like okay. Oh, so he yeah. doesn't really get Monday holiday. No. No. Yeah, we're actually Monday closed holiday. on Monday as well, so I'm excited. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah. And we it's don't so close. Nice we don't close on those three-day weekends very often, so. That's weird. Well, it's because they close us for um, basically all the way from uh, Christmas to New Year's. Like, we, we aren't open that whole time, which, you know, yeah. to make that work out, we sacrifice some of those three-day weekends. That, okay. That makes sense, but it's still... Sometimes a three-day weekend is necessary. Yeah. Sometimes it can be nice. nice. Yeah. Yeah. So the extra day to recuperate. Yes. Oh my goodness. Just to not have to deal with other people. Honestly, all weekends should be three day weekends and we have four day work weeks. That uh, would make more sense. Yep. I would enjoy that. That would be nice. I think I would probably do just about as much work too, to be honest. That's the thing is you're stretching out. A lot of people are stretching out. Um, what they do to get their hours in. Yep. 
and oh yes, here come the melons. Oh, any any gold ones? No, they're not ready to harvest. I just oh, went okay. up to Landon's cabin and saw all of the melons ever. Well, keep them watered since she had to go, please, that's so we can get rainy. one more gold. Well, oh yeah, that's raining today, so no water. <laughs> it's raining today, so we're good. It'll be okay. Oh man, I'm trying to remember which gems we need before I sell them. I hate to oh, get can... rid of something. You can just look. It should, like, tell you. You know, if you go into your inventory, you can click on that little tree icon, and it'll show you. You can go look through all the bundles. Yeah. I usually... Not usually, but when I have to double-check, I, I hover over it and says, Oh, Gunther can tell you more about it mm -hmm. if I haven't donated it yet. Mm -hmm. Got yeah. it. Got a sturgeon. Yay. Yay! We We're it. it. We're being productive. Yes. So we're not going to oh miss goodness. out on fish. I almost got hit by lightning. Uh oh. Not Can you actually get hit by lightning in this game, or is it just the trees that get hit by lightning? I think it's just the trees, but I was chopping a tree next to a tree that got hit, <laughs> and it kind of scared me a little bit. Oh my god. I've never experienced that. Um. I don't recommend it. <laughs> Not my favorite. Not my favorite. Uh, oh my goodness. So, Karen. Yes. My friend. Yes. <laughs> uh, Kitty's been hearing about this, but I have been on a, a hunt, a wild hunt, now that I'm feeling better and have the creative energy to spend again. Uh -huh. uh, for some role play. Oh. And I feel like a secret agent spy person because I'm going into all of these groups and I'm looking to determine, you know, well, are they a good fit for me? All you know, normal group hunting stuff. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you gotta, the... go, you gotta go scope it out a little bit to decide if yeah. it's worth applying to. Yeah, um, none of them are. <laughs> the ones that because i have a very specific itch because my brain hyper focuses and that's fine but it is the most buck wild i know i sent you the no plagiarizing if any of your rp has been found to be plagiarized yes you did send me that i was kind of surprised um i don't um, I, we can talk about that for a second because that really shocked me like okay I understand, like, people being um, jumpy about copying. Like, I don't agree with it, but I understand the motivation. Yes. But using the word plagiarize really blows my mind. Like, how do you plagiarize a role play? I don't understand. I'm so confused. Because even if I you plagiarize, so like, shocked. your character history or something, like, let's say that you do that in your application. You steal somebody else's history or whatever, whatever, okay? Yeah. One, as soon as you start role-playing it, it will change. Like, you can't, like, you can't, it's, you, you can't hold that. So, it's not the same. <laughs> and, you know, if, and, and we've seen that in applications where the bio the first bio doesn't match the second bio that we get when we say, hey, we need a rewrite from, we need this and this added in yeah. there. Um, and we've had people get angry about it and do some like passive aggressive, completely different tone stuff. Oh, yeah. But it still has felt like the same person writing it. Yeah. <laughs> And if it hasn't, it's obvious. But right? even then, it's like, what? This isn't. This isn't a classroom. Yeah, like how? What? How can you plagiarize role play? I I literally like I don't get it. Like the most you can do is copy someone's ideas or style or things like that. You you can't plagiarize because it's interactive. I don't understand. I was very confused. Um, there was a lot of stuff in that server that just made me go, now hold on. <laughs> but that was the one that really just took my brain. <clears throat> How do you... What? And I think part of it is because 
um, at least in the cafe and the RP spaces that I'm involved in, the people who are active and talking are not taking RP intellectual property seriously. Yeah. And are very much like, yeah, this is a cool idea. Let's all hop in on it. Or, hey, this is a cool way to do something. Let's do it this way. Without worrying about, oh, no, I'm copying somebody. So what do you think they think about fan fiction or someone who wants to do a Marvel RP? Like, that's the this same thing. This was a fandom RP. <laughs> yeah. This was a fandom RP. So, like, if they believe that roleplay can be plagiarized, then you would, if they, if you follow that logical conclusion, then that means fandom roleplays are plagiarism as well. Just yes. Because... Inherently. <laughs> Yeah, because you can't really plagiarize, no you can only copy. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but I was blown away. It was like the wild, wild west. Every single group that I find uses Tupper. Every single group is 16 plus. But you have Instead to search for it. Instead of like 18 plus or 21 plus. Yes, you have to search for it. They don't advertise that. And I've asked in a couple places, like, hey, quick question, what's the, what's the age gate here? Like, I, I want to know for my comfort and for the comfort of the players around me. Yeah. What's, what's happening? I think the age gate that you want, you should bump it up a couple of years because you're going to get people pretending to be whatever the lower limit is. You know, that's well, their I, fault. I think people do age <laughs> gates of like 16 and stuff like that, mostly because like they have like a friend that is still a teenager. Oh, dang it. I yeah. killed one of our things. Um, they, they'll oh, like no. have a friend that's still a teenager and they want to include said friend. Like that's Which, what I see a lot of times when they have like an age gate that's like 16 or 15 or like weird like that, not 18. Yeah, it. I a lot of the advertising around that I see is like no edgy thirteen year olds. Yeah, mm -hmm. which is weird. Like, how do you just how how do you? Describe and I'm just that? like my dude, my guy. I hate <laughs> to break it to you, but saying no edgy thirteen year olds makes you sound like an edgy thirteen year old. <laughs> no, Kendra, they're an edgy fifteen year old. God. Oh, sorry. Yeah, <laughs> pretending to be sixteen. And it's wild. I've seen the most, I forget how rampant like, ageism is in RP spaces. Oh yeah, it's crazy. That's... Like heaven forbid that you're above the age of 30. Not even, like if you're, someone said, if you're 24, you should have better things to do than writing on Discord. Like what, what are you even doing here? And I'm like, 24? I'm sorry, That's this rude. person sounds sad. I know. And I'm just like, dude, my friend, who do you think makes the show? Who do you think writes the books? Who do you think makes the fan edits? Who do you think cultivates the fandom with fan content? Like, they really do think it's children writing their favorite fanfics. They really do think they that. They do. And I'm just sitting here going, you need to get into Star Trek. You need to get into Star Trek, please kid please go get into star trek so you know but like then at 24 are they thinking that people just go work in the factories for old people yeah mm -hmm. and they, they, they think that you start popping out kids and you're too busy you're too busy with um doing taxes and yard work and old people factory jobs or I something mean, I, am, I don't know but like <laughs> like there are there's time in the day to do like enjoyable stuff. Mm -hmm. No, I think there's like I think so there's like wild. a whole thing and it's getting worse where people really are like is. seriously scared to grow up and they take that out on other people online. They do. It's sad. It's really sad. It's been one of the best things getting older. Yeah. <laughs> it's like honestly, um, like it just makes everything better. It does. And these kids don't know that. It does. And, like, that's fine. Like, you don't need to, oh, I don't like it when the bats open their eyes in the cave. That gives me a fright. <laughs> um, forgot that <laughs> happened. Poor Kendra. <laughs> I feel like you stopped restricting your writing 
And a lot of the problems that I hear that you have in the servers are just how restricting they're making things unnecessarily. Yes, um, a lot of the time. The first thing I do when I check out a new server is I go to their rules just to see, because if I don't want to follow the rules, I'm not sure. going to be a good fit. Saves everybody time. And I have a complaint a bit. <laughs> about some rules that I found. I want to hear them. I want to hear the T. Worst rules you've seen. Don't say anything that would, like, identify the servers. No, but, like, no. Worst I, rules you've seen. I want to hear I it. don't even have server identifying information in the um, in the screenshots that I take. Because <laughs> I'm like, oh, no, good. this is this is just for just for my giggles. Um, but I, I want to hear them. I want to giggle. Tell me the stupid rules. Uh, my favorite is... Well, my favorite favorite is the no plagiarizing. Mm -hmm. um, but I've seen a lot of, you can have, you can only have three ongoing scenes. Oh, that like the weird time locks that people- Weird time lock, but shit. only one scene in the present and two scenes set in the past. What? So you can and do I'm flashback like, scenes? <laughs> I have cities here going, hold, how do you keep track of that? I'm confused. <laughs> Yeah, that's really strange. I remember one that you shared with us was like, if you have a scene going that is taking a long time, somebody who's, plays. yeah, somebody yeah. faster than you can steal your spot. Yes. <gasps> what? Y'all, yes. I would go bonkers. I would I saw lose that my like, shit if not. someone did that to me. Slow role plays. If you're writing a scene that's taking more than a few days to finish, and somebody wants that channel, then your scene can be forced closed so that a few people... days after yes, a, a few days. days. <laughs> <laughs> and this is a server with a week activity limit, and because I'm not joining anything with like a few day activity limit, I know myself, I can't do that. So it's like they their activity that's not real then. So their activity I limit know. doesn't match the way they do the way they force close threads. Mm -hmm. I know. Oh my oh, god. It, it like just I don't understand. It was buck wild bonkers. Uh saw some people getting upset. Did we get all the melons? Yes, I just turned them in. Okay. Oh, there's a train. I'm gonna I go try to train. catch the train. Go but I, and I got my steel axe, light. so I'll go open up the secret woods <gasps> too. Yay! Yay! Special mushrooms. Yes. Mushroom, mushroom. Badger, 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 badger. badger. Did you hear? Badger. MVP of the Pokemon run was the Badger Hypno. Oh, man. I started showing my little sisters, like, original memes. And they were very confused. <laughs> really? I mean, the youngest is going to be 20 in October. Mm-hmm. So, and they were just sitting here going, like, people liked that? Yes, we liked it. It was like, cool. Yeah. cool. It was the first time anything like this has happened. And they're like, what is this dancing baby? Why is this, like, okay? <laughs> that baby was creepy, though. The baby it was, was creepy. Do y'all remember that came from Allie now. McBeal? Do y'all remember that? Mm hmm Yep. Mm hmm That was a show. Creepy. It just, it, like, what, why? Why did that need to be? We loved it. I know. I also <laughs> remember Magical Trevor. Yes. Oh my goodness. Magical Trevor was great. The the hamster dance original web page. Yes. <laughs> of just all of the hamsters. I don't I think like I've ever felt dance. that old. <laughs> As I did. Going through OG, like the very first memes of the internet and be like, oh yeah, this was this was the the whole big thing. Well, Karen was just posting like, the glow oh. graphics. <clears throat> oh, I love man, those. I know. They were so good. Mm -hmm. it's, I miss internet. I miss Web 1.0 a lot. It was, it was okay. Like, it was not the worst thing possible. Yeah, I feel like um, I feel like since since Web two like the internet in a lot of ways is garbage compared to how it used to be. 
Oh, did she have red... any red cabbage? No, but I did pick up a rare seed for next okay. season. Yeah, so we can save that. Well, gosh darn it, we need red cabbage. Oopsie doodle. I forgot about the hot dog monster. Uh, All right, Secret me? Woods is now open, so we can come forward oh, here. Oh, hot dog monster. Yeah, the doggy. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I was very worried. It's like, hold on. He looks like a hot dog. Yep. From the pits of hell. He sure does. <laughs> but monster looks like a hot dog. The little doggies, they're in the sands of the mine. Oh. If you walk in the sand. You're right, they do look like little hot dogs poking up out of the sand. Ooh, oh, oh no, no. A, swarm. a swarm. I'm out. I'm out. Bye. Bye. <laughs> you scared? Don't be scared. Have, a, have proper a proper weapon, weapon for a swarm. swarm. Uh, that's the hard part. We have a lot of copper now, though, so I don't know how much of it we need, but... I'm getting there. We could probably sell some and then um, open another thing at the vault. Yeah. Um, if y'all want, also, do you need to upgrade your weapons to copper version, or is this steel is steel the first upgrade? I can't remember if you use copper for your first round of upgrades. For your tools. Um, it, my pickaxe looks no. I don't know. I, I should tell you copper is the also. first round of upgrades. All right. Well, yeah, use I think that copper. Is. Use that copper to do some upgrades for you guys. Okie dokie. Oh, sugar. Sugar? Yeah, the little caterpillars, if I don't kill them in time. And I had a uh, green monster. Yeah. It's fine. It's rude of them. Super rude. Gosh, man. Sorry, I'm still just like, oh, that's low roleplay roll. Rule. Well, Kendra, oh, hold on. how do you feel about, um... Like doing a D and D again or something like that to scratch the roleplay itch. I think probably D and D isn't. It's a different type of. Um. Oh, it's eight o'clock. Why did I think I could go upgrade my tools? Yeah, you gotta um, do it tomorrow. Yeah. Yep. Mhm. Mm um, D and D is a different sort of creative outlet for me. That's true as as a player as a dm so i'm sitting here going oh it would be fun and then i look at my notes and i'm like i have no idea where we were <laughs> shoot um but it's fine it just doesn't hit the same spot of your brain yeah i understand it's oh, not frequent shit. enough is my other problem <laughs> yeah that's true um... trying to find times for everyone to get together does not happen super often no, it doesn't, and it's a time commitment of a few hours in whatever time we get. And I'm just like, that's that's rough. It's rough. Yeah, see, for me, that's why I can make it work, because I can say, like, I'm busy during this time. Whereas, mm -hmm. like, if it's, like, the written role play, that's what, why I am not in one right now, is yeah. because trying to find, like, five minutes or ten minutes every day to read and, and write is, like, it just doesn't happen. It just gets pushed off to the back burner and then it just never happens. For me too, when I'm busy, it's not even just like yeah. the five or 10 minutes, but I feel like it requires so many more spoons to enjoy it and soak it in and then think about it and then put something out there. Yeah. Yes, it does. It requires a lot of spoons. It, yeah, unfortunately. That's why I'm like, I know that I cannot run anything right now. That is beyond me beyond my capabilities at the moment yeah that makes so sense. i'm at the mercy and, I... and the, the mercy is not there <laughs> there was one that was like oh yeah it's based off of media like x y and z and the admins then like a day later I've we've never read X, Y, or Z. Like, what? Then how are you basing this off of that? What are you doing? <laughs> so it wasn't Loosely. really based off of it. It was just that same genre then. Yeah, like that's okay. That's different. I did see someone put in the suggestion channel the channel topic 
was, and I got really excited about this because I was like, oh my gosh, I don't see Tupper in the bot list. Finally, <laughs> finally, yes. Someone put, ask for Tupper and I'll eat you as the <gasps> channel topic for suggestions. Oh. And I was like, this is it. This has to be it. My golden one. <laughs> and it was 16 plus. And I was like, I, I, everything is awful. Uh, everything is bad. So you did, but you didn't like anything else about it. I, I did. There were a couple of other things that were like, I mean, you know, this, I'll, the culture of the server seems solid. Uh, but 16 plus and oh, there was one other thing that I was like, no, I, I can't, I can't vibe with this. And I, I don't remember what it was. Hold on. Sixteen plus reminds me of how we used to do things like back in the day on right. um, Tumblr RP, where it yes. was like we didn't have age gates. We just put um, all the nasty stuff under read more, and if you were under eighteen, you were expected to not click it. But I know all them kids clicked it. But that's yeah. how we did things back then. That was like the norm. It was really weird, but that's how we did it. It was it was weird. It was normal for the platform, and it's under a read more at that point. That's on you boo boo yeah this kind of was our attitude on uh on those back in the tumblr days dang it i keep I... having my tool in my hand and oh. destroying our crops i'm sorry you guys oh no i have done that yep multiple times it's finally oh, cool. not raining today it rained two days in a row <clears throat> nice i didn't yeah. have to water that was why i had so much energy at the end of the day Yep. Um, there is a server on Discord now that originated on Tumblr for connecting role players to other, you know, X group or whatever. Mm -hmm. Like connect. It's a Tumblr role player connection service. Basically, like, hey, you know, here you can advertise your role plays here. The cool part about it is that it organizes the um, the advertising sections in a few different ways, but one way is here's a spot for Discord only role plays. Mm. Here's a spot for the JC, whatever. The J J Kink or J Sync? I'm not sure how you say it. I don't know how you say it. I'm very confused by it. I just I just show up. <laughs> but they have sections for that and i'm like that's fantastic that's great thank you because i'm so tired of seeing a really cool role play and then it's being a jc whatever yeah and then you're like oh i don't really want to do that platform yeah i that's that's not for me and getting disappointed mm -hmm. so that's it's great it's fantastic however i've also um because of that been exposed to Tumblr again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Which, so yeah. I, I, I've heard that it's like it's a lot better now. People really love that like blaze it feature. So I went back yes. on my Tumblr and queued up all the videos that I never posted just to kind of like see what was up with it. And I don't know, it's honestly really not that different um than how it used to be. I don't I don't I don't know. Um it's still very hard to freaking find anything on that website. It is so, so that's hard to still find a thing on that website, um, which is why because the tags are bad this, and yeah, people the, the have been it, moving to Discord mm -hmm. for role playing, mm -hmm. but still advertising their role plays on Tumblr. Um, the admins of this group were like, "Oh, this is something people need." Yeah, they're not wrong. It is. Yeah, I definitely think like the tags. The tags like make it so that you really cannot find what you want on Tumblr still. Like they have not fixed it since the last time I was on there a couple years ago. The the tags are not. The nice part is that the people for the vast majority of users that I know of on Tumblr are fandom olds. Mm -hmm. Like they're just they're older people who you know know what they're talking about <laughs> there's not as many kids on there anymore not as many kids and it's more um like don't like don't read 
yeah. type of culture and like just let people do what makes them happy don't don't worry about it you don't need to police other people those are the good vibes yes. yeah it's good chill vibes silly goofy stories uh which is enjoyable for me mm-hmm. let's see i'm going to get i don't need a hoe yet but we will there we go um there's new prizes at the museum oh yay oh yeah i just went there and like grabbed a bunch of them did we get a um a milk like a pail for when the cows grow up but we can milk them i don't see uh, one I, in i've got it chest. you got it oh okay yeah, I must have already gotten the museum collections. Because it was not there for me. I put a pair of sneakers in the chest. Does anyone need sneakers? It only has um, one defense. No, I have the no. um, Firewalker boots right now, which is plus three, plus three. Okay. I've got the Tundra. I need to go <laughs> well, back into the mines. It's been a minute. <laughs> Let's see. Let's traverse the mines a little bit today. I'm gonna upgrade my axe. Or my, so many my pickaxe. Oh, our copper's gone. Yes, I upgraded my hoe. Oh. Yes, I decided it was time to upgrade them. So that in fall, I can just big plant. Makes sense. Yes. The other ones I'm using a lot more frequently right now. Whee. Oh man, this sword sucks. There we go. <laughs> He'll make it. He'll do it. Um, so when I first when I first went into the secret wood, I went ahead and got the wood skip. But I did not get, um, and I got fiddlestick for the ferns, but I didn't see any morals in there. I think, aren't morals, um, <laughs> more common in fall? Um, maybe, or maybe spring, I'm not really sure. I don't remember. But I know that's where we get it from. I just can't remember which seasons. Yeah, I've got the forest farm on my home save, so I they, they yes. just spawn for me. Forest farm is my favorite. <laughs> it's it definitely counts. easy mode, I feel like, when it comes to community center completion. Yes. Huge yes. I, was, I saw the pictures and I was like, I just want to be in the woods with my chickens that sounds like a good time for me <laughs> and then it was like oh here's all the benefits i said ha ha yeah i feel like that one's like easy mode and like the beach one's kind of like the hard mode you know yeah beach mode seems really hard yeah because you can't do sprinklers like unnecessarily they make a mod hard. for it though yeah you can mod the sprinklers into the beach farm if you want to you sound like that disappoints you. <laughs> well, it's just kind of like it's just kind of like it's silly. I feel like it should be a toggle, but I don't know. Maybe some people like that. I, you know, there are lots of different ways to play games. That's true. I don't understand most of them. And the truth is, the type of farm you pick really only matters for like your first year or two, and because yeah. then like you other things happen, and then it doesn't matter anymore. You get the upgrades. Exactly. I don't even use my farm anymore. At my point, I just use my greenhouse. Yep, yeah. I do too. I just use the greenhouse. And then you can end up getting on the, you know, the island. And then you have like a mm -hmm. whole other farm that's like way fancy. Yes. Nothing ever oh. goes out of season. Mm -hmm. No. It's so nice. I just, I haven't gotten it to where my family will come and stay at the farm with me. So I feel like I'm running off and abandoning my children <laughs> oh my god can you even do that i've never tried i don't can you get know. your family to come there with you i feel like you should be able to yeah but i, I don't am think telling you, can. you as soon as i reached full hearts with my children i never acknowledge them again yes oh me goodness. too <laughs> 
I, uh, <laughs> the children are boring in this game. I mean, I get that, that the way the game is designed, you don't want time to pass, but also, like, the children are freaking boring. The children are boring, <laughs> yes. Um, once they get past the stage of just staring at you in your dark house as you come running back in from the mines at 1 a.m., there's mm -hmm. just a tiny child. <laughs> yeah, they don't sleep! Mm -hmm. They're just open in bed. <laughs> they so do not creepy. sleep. <laughs> Hey, Blue, welcome in, welcome in. Happy to have you here. We're doing our Stardew Valley Community Day. So we've got Kendra and Kitty with us. All of my children are from my Alessio's affair with the wizard. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I... What? Mm -hmm. Excuse me? I gave my children wizard's hat so I can pretend that even though I love Harvey, the wizard oh. would give me better offsprings with more power. Oh. Did you... I feel I like something <laughs> happened there. Like maybe Kitty um, died in the mines, and Harvey still charged her, and she was like angry, and so she's like, yeah. "Fuck you, Harvey! Yeah. These kids aren't yours." The role yeah. play writes itself. Yeah, I, I, I love you. You're fantastic. <laughs> One day, when they have to learn the dark arts, they'll find out who their true father is. <laughs> they have to. Yes. You can only heal so much as a doctor with a doctor father. That's you true. You want to know the stronger ways of magic. Exactly. Have to? Do you know how often you die in this quiet little town? Yes. <laughs> a lot. It's, it's a lot. <laughs> There's a lot of necromancy, if you think about it. How else do people survive? That is true. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm going through and selling some things that are just like we just don't need this and we need because we need money yeah. yeah we probably at once upon a time we're saving it for for like something but we don't need building anymore. yeah mm. just in case oh wait I know the most wild thing I've seen what uh, um having to uh do trigger warnings and the spoiler which is fine on its own um however what was trigger warned and spoiled warning the sentence was you know this person's father soon passed away <clears throat> that why do it. you have to trigger warn that because it's a death trigger okay and that was the most Tumblr thing yeah, that I have ever Tumblr. seen in a Discord roleplay. You know what's just crazy to me? Like, I feel like Tumblr has really ruined how triggers and stuff even work. Because, yes. like, tri getting triggered by something is not like, oh, something that everyone thinks is sad or everyone thinks is gross. I had to witness and therefore I'm triggered. Like, it's not that. It's, it's things like, that. I'm scared when someone knocks on the door because my parents always knocked on my bedroom door before they were going to yell at me or you know like that's yeah. what a trigger is it's like stuff that's like half nonsensical that your body remembers that is just like ridiculous and, and makes you have a reaction a physical reaction it's yeah. not a squick yeah it's mm -hmm. not it's not so like it just it's very strange to me if i think about like how triggers work in the real world versus how we pretend they work online it's, it's just very like sad. it's literally people are just like never ever make me uncomfortable or I will make that your problem. Yeah, yes. it's like oh my god, that's not how that, this works. No, no, it's like you guys were talking about in the running online communities. That's not what a safe space is. No, it's not. It is not what a safe space is. Okay, we have and copper bars again. Was. Apparently, we 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 got a bunch of copper, so we have copper bars again. I'm I putting them back. Of copper too. Oh, okay. sugar snap keys. Or at least I think I put them back. Uh oh, hold on. <clears throat> yes, I did put them back. I'm coming home. I'm just getting out of a swarm. That's okay. I think I was the first one to go to bed, and it's midnight. We're all very late tonight. Leave my. Actually, let me check something. Yeah, I okay, have so to get tomorrow out of is to go check. tomorrow is the dance of the moonlight jellies, so we can't miss that tomorrow night. Yes. Okay. 
We got to the moonlight jellies. We mm-hmm. did it. We did it. <laughs> And we caught our summer fish, and we got Yay. our our five star melons. So like, we did really I'm good so for the summer. Yeah, yeah, we did good. Nice to feel productive. Mm-hmm. So Kendra, Ooh, if you're you. feeling if you're feeling okay on on Monday, are we gonna have a Kendra stream? Yes, if I'm good on Monday, we are having a Kendra stream. Okay, so we're gonna shout you out. Um, so if you guys are not following Kendra, you definitely need to fix that. Mm-hmm. We're going to go take our medieval yeah, Europe. And they yes, don't. we're playing it. We're playing a clip right it's now of it. Family. Why not? Let's just do oh, it. Let's just do it. It's silly. It's fun. We made good money last night. Yeah, we did. We just told Damn. you you're going to come help us. Because I've sold a bunch of stuff was in our chests. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to put money in the vault or do we want to put money in the vault? Yeah, we can. We yeah, can buy another we, one. We should. Tonight at around 10 o'clock p.m., a rare and beautiful event will take place. It's called Me Entering Dreamland. <laughs> Please and thank you. <laughs> okay, I upgraded my watering can, so I, I can't water these plants, um, FYI. Okay, if anybody wants to water them, you can, but they're all like regrow plants. Like, it doesn't really matter that much if we miss a day or two. Okay. Then they're gonna My... die. Some of them are gonna die today, anyways. This is their last day. Well, because it's um, it's gonna flip over to fall. That's true. Darn fall. A watering Hello. can is in the mines, but I will grab it. Your watering can is in the mines. I, I oh. got it. I'm dealing with chickens right now, but but I can get it. It's okay. okay. Whatever y'all want to do. I'll go upgrade my axe then. Yes. Or my my pickaxe, not my axe axe. The path between. There we go. Link, link. We trash. You got me bread. My bread trash. Yay! Yay. Trash bread. We love trash bread. Feels bad. <laughs> it's so nutritious, though. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. So wait, you're saying you wouldn't eat trash bread, Kendra? I don't think I would, no. I'm I would be too anxious about what is on the bread. <laughs> <laughs> well, first of all, mold is penicillin, so it's extra good for you. Um, oh, I'm allergic though. Yeah, oh, that's also not how that works. <laughs> Shut up, Kendra. God. No, no, I really, for really, am allergic to penicillin. Oh It'll no! It'll kill me. I... No, no, you, oh, you being allergic to penicillin—that is a real thing. That happens. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not disparaging you at all. <laughs> Let me disparage Kitty. I had to get. Um, it's not penicillin. Now that I'm thinking about it, it was a Pitocin drip when I was giving birth. And Oh. Oh, yeah. If you don't know, then uh -huh. what happens is they put an IV in your arm, and it feels like your entire arm caught fire, but you can't see the fire. Yep. Yep. They're like, it's going to be a little bit burny, and then it's like <laughs> on fire. And it's like, a little bit? It's a, a lot of it. I don't think you understand what little means. Yep. Bro? It's the pregame. <sighs> Alright. We have 26k. Should one of us buy the 36 slot upgrade? It's 10k for that. Is anybody is anybody still only have like one row? Oh shoot, I didn't mean to click it. God That's okay. It. I have two yeah. rows. Fine. You I've two got rows. two rows. Okay, well I've got all three rows now, so and we have enough we have enough that someone else can get their third row as well, if y'all want. I am good. I haven't I haven't used up all my slots in the mines, so Okay. Yeah, I'll I'll be okay for a second. <clears throat> I want to I, I, I know that we have pretty a good ton. for fishing. Yeah, we've got a ton of like fall seeds, but Yeah, we do. I like to just wait until after the first few days of the season before spending big money. So we can go but we can go ahead and plant tomorrow what we have. Yeah. Oh my goodness, Mary Lewis, don't talk to me about blueberries. 
<sighs> jerk. Oh, I can't go forage there. Okay. Wee. <laughs> Wee. Wee. I <laughs> <laughs> just yay. Oh man. All right. So if we're not gonna do that, I just want to look at our animal situation. So we need to upgrade to get more an different animals. Do y'all want to upgrade our coop or our barn first? Um, I think that mayonnaise and cheese are the most important things in the beginning, personally. Okay. Yeah. And we have two cows, so more chickies would be. My mayonnaise empire really helped me in my yeah. personal game. So we want to I... upgrade the coop, you think? Is that what you're saying? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I am enjoying the mayonnaise. And then we can get a bunny too cool. for wool. Oh no, wait. What is it? No, we can get a duck. You can yeah, get a the duck, for the duck feathers. Yeah. Yeah. And um, then we need the duck feathers and we need a duck egg too. How much does it cost to do the coopy? I'm I'm checking right now. I just got a all of our I got a bunch of um stone and wood and I'm look, going to look with Robin. Um construct farm buildings. Okay. We've got about three rare seeds. I think that's all the rare seeds we need. That's probably fine. Yeah. Okay, so a big coop is 10k, just like the bag upgrade would be. So we can do that for sure. And then we would still have more than 5k left to put money in the vault if we wanted to. Yeah. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do the big coop. Do it. Make it rain. Make it rain, duck feathers. There we duck go. Duck mayonnaise. <laughs> there we go. All right, and, and that's all. all of our money. <laughs> Woohoo! We got quality fertilizer from the vault. I'll bring it to the chest. Yay! Sweet. We can fertilize our pumpkins if we want, because that should get us some more money. Because we're finished yes. on the quality crops bundle, because you only have to do three of the four. So that's yeah. done. But, um, okay. but that'll be more money if we fertilize our pumpkins. Yes. Oh, it's Tarvi. Well, look at you. You found him. I don't have Go anything to he wants. Him. And? <laughs> when has that stopped a person? <laughs> you can still talk to him. Yeah. He says he's struggling to make ends meet. Mm. Aw. <laughs> Sorry, Harvey. Harvey. Harvey, come, come live on the co-op. We're not struggling to make ends meet. <laughs> yeah, we're doing pretty good. I mean, we just made some really big purchases, and we're pretty happy with them, so, you know, I'm just saying. Oh, no, I would just like to pet the chicken. Okay. I have a mod that changes the sprites slightly for the animals, and I'm just, they like, super cute on my screen, I'm just saying. Yes. I'm, like, very excited oh, about it. They're so cute. What was I doing? Oh. I, mean, I yeah, love liquors. We... <laughs> I like liquor too. I just I think we got some limoncello in the house. Maybe I should get a limoncello. The goofy names. <laughs> nugget. <laughs> nugget. It's my nuggets. Okay. All right. Let's come here. I don't remember that being there but that's okay we'll make some jam <clears throat> cool cool great good yeah did you uh -huh. find the preserves jar yes it was just not by the other preserves jars so I oh was i didn't know there was a spot but you can move it <laughs> i'll move it once it's done okay preserving i didn't know we had other ones so that's my bad <laughs> oh it's fine it's down with like the the honey box mm. That's oh, not... I do remember we had honey and preserves over there. Yes. Are our pumpkins on a different farm than our main one? No, we don't I, have I saw... pumpkins yet. Oh. <laughs> tomorrow we can, but tomorrow we can plant some pumpkins. Yes. What time is a jellyfish? I I thought it was started at like four or five, but it won't let me in yet. So maybe it, it starts actually later. Like... Yeah, until like eight. Let's see the letter. I'm gonna fish while I'm waiting. Or it ten. Let me one in. One of the two. Oh, it starts at ten. I think it might start at 10. Okay. Those buttholes. I, I know it was later in the day, but I couldn't remember. It's, yes. It's one of those ones where it's like you can do everything ever during the day. 
and then it's bedtime. Yeah, that's why I wanted to double check because I was like, I was like, I feel like that one's one that's easy to miss because it's so late in the day. Yes. But it's one of my favorite cutscenes. It's just so pretty. It's so pretty. Oops. Oh, wait. Let's go yeah. this way. La 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 la. <coughs> I'm gonna go put a tapper on this tree. What's up, kitty? Just two chicks fishing. Yep. Since I and since I mod out the fishing game, this it, for me anyway is the fastest way to get money is to fish. Yes. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Matthew still gives me grief about modding the fishing game. <laughs> Well, Matthew can do play how he wants. I know. I told him, I was like, what are you, like, no, that's not fun for me. He goes, you just it's have like to the, practice. It's like the no, only part understand. of the game I don't like, so. I have a real strong aversion to rhythm type games. Oh, I see. Like that, where it just, it, my brain does not work that way. I guess it is kind of a rhythm game, but there's no music or anything, so there's it's, no it's music. Not, but it's like that I like rhythm games. Tapping. Yeah, I mean, I I like rhythm games, but you know, there's no music there, so I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Like, I don't understand it. Yeah, there was a Nancy Drew game where to progress in the storyline, you had to hop in on drums for this Irish band and play Nancy Drew Rock Band. Oh my god. And it was the hardest thing. And Nancy Drew, there's always one mini game in a Nancy Drew game that you just look at. It's the worst thing you've ever seen until you play the next Nancy Drew game. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, it must be 10 p.m. It still doesn't let me in. Yeah. Yeah, um, those Nancy Drew games are crazy, Kendra. They're absolutely I, crazy. My goodness. I'm. It's been long enough now to where I'm sitting here going, ooh, you know what I could do? I could do, like, my favorite Nancy Drew game. Well, didn't you start, didn't in you start a, a playthrough of it? I did start a playthrough. Not, uh, it's, uh, it's a Labyrinth of Lies, and I did finish it, just not on stream. It was dumb. Um... <laughs> It was not good. No, the, I no. was very entertained. I'll say that for that stream. I'm that glad I you were entertained. It was so. It it did not do the good things that Nancy Drew games can do. It was very well, def frustrating. Definitely after I get to a certain point in um, Final Fantasy X, because we're gonna go in my stream. We're gonna go back to that on Thursdays. I'm so um, excited. Yes. So once we once we get to that. Um, I'm gonna play Riven, I think. Um, Koneko said yes. that they would be interested in seeing it. And um, and Riven is just, it's one of those games, it's very hard. But yeah. once you get it, and once you see the whole thing, it's like the most genius puzzle game to ever have ever been made. It's it's amazing. Oh yeah. Like, I can't wait to show it to you guys. I, I like to watch excited. people do puzzles, because I'm not good at them, but I like to see them done. Right? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, you're so smart, how'd you see that? <laughs> yeah, oh, weird. Well, uh, my my secret yeah. is um, practicing off stream. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I just wanted to get past the. I think I was like stuck on some like fire thing, where I accidentally went into a part of the game, and I didn't that you weren't supposed to go to until like end game. Oh. Oh. Oops. Yeah, but you could get out of it. I just didn't know that you could get out of it. So you thought you were stuck in that room. Yes, and I was just like, I have no idea how to solve any of these puzzles. Oh no. What's Oops. happening? Linus, you're not bothering anybody. I didn't even see him. Is he off to the He's the beach? off. Yeah, he's off by Elliot's cabin. Yep. He's a uh, He doesn't like to join in with everybody. I know. Hi, Harvey. <laughs> Let's see. Is do we, you smell like the wizard? <laughs> Here's the wizard. I'm happy to say goodbye to the mosquitoes too, Harvey. Yeah, man. Pollen season up here has been 
buck wild. I was driving home the other day, and to get home from my in-laws, I have to drive over a mountain pass. Oh. And it and it's beautiful national forest section, gorgeous. Um, there was yellow fog. Fog. Like mm. it was. It was just the pollen from the pine trees, because we've had such an on and off again. Harvey, I just saw you over there. Yeah, he moves. He moves during <laughs> this event. Excuse you. Um, don't follow me. Go away. Oh, he okay. chose you. I've no. talked to everybody. Y'all, let me know when you're ready. We can. I, yeah, I, I have too. talked to everybody. Okay. Yes, let's launch the boats. And it was just like the pollen was coming off of these trees in puffs. And because it had been raining earlier and the sun was, like, it was doing that, like, you know, water cycle thing where it mm. heats and it goes up and you can see the vapor. <clears throat> the pollen was in the vapor. <laughs> oh, my God. And I was just like, this doesn't look right. This looks frightening. Am I in a scary video game? <coughs> what? Yeah, that's like that's like zombie fog. That's, when we see stuff like that, we call it zombie fog. Yeah, it was it was weird. It was, I don't um, recommend having a spring that starts and stops about five different times. <laughs> uh, well, that's just how it is now. Climate change and everything. I know it was it was such a weird spring. The ski resort in my town is we got open. some babies. Yeah, I love the baby babies. jellies. I don't see any green jellies, but we got some baby jellies. I love the ones that look like the Mario flowers. Yeah, the thing oh, that's the green one. I call those the green ones. Oh, yeah, there's a green one. Those don't spawn as often. They're the rare ones. You can have this person without any green ones sometimes. We, we've got we've got it. We got babies and we got green. They're special. Mm -hmm. I love jellyfish. It just jellyfish. works so hard. Jellyfish are some of the coolest freaking looking animals like in the world. They though. freak me out. So really? Much. Yes. Just um, because I know that they can hurt me. Mm. I have a modest view of my own mortality. Oh. I feel like well, I the... I did get stung by a man of war once, and I thought I was gonna die. Like that did happen. Oh. Ow. I was at the yeah, beach, I and I just say... got they were they were just in the water, and I got stung by one. Yikes. I would not want to experience that. No. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Gosh, but I didn't live. I didn't actually die. I really? Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. I don't know. You're not streaming from beyond the grave. I could be. I could <laughs> be. Could I mean, be. we would never as, know. As far as you guys know, when Landon came and visited, like she could be just lying about me she actually could be. existing. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hmm. I'm going to be a gatherer. I got my oh, you had the choice. upgrade. Yeah. It was like, oh, you could get more wood from trees. I was like, yeah, but I want to get more grapes when I pick them up off the ground. Grapes. When we have hot peppers, can I steal one? Oh, you have the hot pepper quest? Yeah. Yeah. Well, we I don't think the hot peppers are gone now. Yeah. They're summer. I wasn't paying attention. They are summer food. There we go. Okay. All right. My my copper hoe is ready. Yay. Oh, I forgot to pick all the flowers. Darn it. Oh, well. That's fine. We just gonna but um but um but um but um <laughs> slowly make my way all the way across the map. Yeah, I gotta go get that too. Get it. Well, I gotta go get my watering can that I was upgrading. I took care of the animals, but I don't have a bucket for the cows. I are they adults now? Oh, uh, they've check. been too young to milk. They don't. They only take some a couple of days to grow up, so they might be. Yeah, I think they are adult. Okay, but maybe oh. I'm wrong. They look adult to me. I they look adult. I keep trying to melt them, and it keeps saying, oh, they're too young to produce. Okay. Yeah, it takes a few days. Fine. <clears throat> I can wait. Let me in, Clint. You creep. 
let me in too. Let me in. <laughs> <laughs> I need to upgrade my hoe and get my watering can. I want my pickaxe back. <laughs> Clint, what a <is> sec. <laughs> this is the only time you're ever going to have a horde of, of people outside your shop. Come on, Clint. <laughs> let me in. <sighs> okay. It's fine. Oh, I forgot how mean Shane is. <laughs> That's why we love him. I'm gonna marry him someday. And I'll get the ugly room on my house, but it'll be okay. Oh my goodness. He was His literally like, so why ugly. are you talking to me? His room is so <laughs> ugly. I hate that. Shane deserves a better room. Yay, copper hoe. Thank you. My friend. Goodbye. Forever. Until the next update. Yep. Yeah, until I need you again. Hello. I went ahead and put the steel hoe in, so I'll, I'll have all steel tools. Um, nice. So we'll have that. But we gotta build up our money again now at this point. Yep. <clears throat> it's okay. Fall is fall is good money making. Yes, it is. Time. I, I do appreciate it. Yep. And I'm about to go plant these pumpkins. Yes. Fertilize the pumpkins. I will. I got the fertilizer out. Oh, good. Me. Mushroom, mushroom. Badger, 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 badger. Hee <laughs> hee. I, oh my goodness. I guess I'll fish today until my pickaxe is ready. That's a good yeah. idea. Right, I planting over here. I need to move this. There we go. Bonk. Here we go. Yee. Whee. Okay, Thank pumpkins you. are planted. Woo. Good. Do we have any other fall seeds we need to do? Or do we need to buy some? Um, the rare seeds? Aren't they fall? Yes, rare seeds are fall. Do we Not want to seeds. plant those, or do we want to hold those until we have a greenhouse? Hmm. I, that's, I, I I'm just asking because that's what I usually do, but I don't I don't care. Like, whatever y'all want to do, if we want to plant I them, haven't been able to get mine to grow in the greenhouse. Oh, mine really? Grow in the greenhouse. Yeah. yeah, I grow them in the greenhouse. Then let's wait. Okay. And, then when, and then I turn them into more seeds. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yep, because then, you, then you'll have to wait until the lady has them and stuff. It's just easier. Ugh, yeah. She is running a good con. Yes, she is. Mm -hmm. My god. Okay, we need another silo. <laughs> I'm being overrun. Okay. By grass. And our silo's full. Uh, it's just about to be full. Because we don't have many animals. That's true. And we do need to buy another duck. So, that's, I guess, the next things to buy is a duck. And we need to buy another silo. Oh, yep. That didn't take long. It's full now. Yeah. We are not, um... Okay, got that. Great. Good. Let's see. Can I milk a cow today? Can I come milk you? Yes. Yay, we can get milk. Hey, today. today is the first day I can milk the cows. Woohoo. We've done it. Let me go check out the secret woods. We did it. We did I it. I can't remember if that has anything in the fall that we need. Yeah, uh, I think that's when you mushroom. get the mushrooms. And the uh, fiddle fern? No, uh, we, we, got we already fiddle got the fern fiddle in fern. summer. Yeah. yeah, we already got it. Oh, we need to buy eggplant and yam to seeds for the community bundle. A common mushroom and hazelnut. Okay. That's the fort for the foraging. Do we need a common mushroom for the foraging? Yeah, we need a common mushroom. Okay, I've got a common mushroom. Oh, good. Um, it needs to go in the um, in one of the community bundles, the foraging section, in the crafts room. Perfect. I will go deliver. 
Oh, yep. There's beep, another beep. common mushroom. Beep, beep, beep. I can feel useful. I want the little red mushrooms that grow to the side. So badly. <laughs> the normal red ones, or...? No, not the normal red ones. The ones that you can't access. They're like just a all. sprite. Yeah. They, don't, they aren't really anything. They grow up on those ledges where you can't actually access. Oh man, I've had so many jellies. <laughs> Remind me to put a jelly. Uh, we're going to have a jelly and a honey soon, so we can get that for the artisan bundle. Oh, fabulous. As well as uh, fruit that the bats are dropping. Those bats are the best. Drop duck egg, large egg. Okay. Did you say we have a jelly though already, or is it this one that's happening in the preserves? Yeah, there's a couple preserves happening. Okay. <clears throat> I've been for. Do we have a TV? We have a TV, right? Yeah, in in uh, my house, in yep. the big house. I've been forgetting to watch it for the recipes on Wednesday. Yes. <laughs> we need those. Yes. Whee. Okay. Here we go. And I think hazelnuts are... Hazelnut? Yeah, we're going to need a hazelnut, too. I think they're up here. Newt, newt. Yes, it is fall already. Okay. Finally. Finally Yay. fall. <clears throat> I cannot wait for allergy season to be over. Oh my god, yeah. It's been really bad this year for me. It oh. has been. It has been. Like, I, I always suffer from allergies, right? But, like, Levi doesn't have very bad allergies, but he's actually had some allergy symptoms this, this season. Um, wow. Which is super rare for him. It's just, like, the pollen's just been crazy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It feels like it started late up here. Now all of the like little cotton trees are letting go of their fluff. Mm -hmm. I'm like, please stop. Oh yeah, we have those here too. Uh, the cotton wood is awful. Just looks like it's snowing. Yes. <laughs> Which snow, fine. The fluff that they put out kills me that's it that's that's how to end kendra is just put her in a room of that and then Cotton i'm, I'm done i'm done that's it goodbye we don't have those i don't think i don't know what y'all are talking about oh you know when you pick up the weeds after they've um turned into the dandelions you can blow mm -hmm. imagine that but it's a tree full of it and it just always blows out of the tree yes oh my god as that's crazy and for whatever reason, that's that's the one that gets me. Because it gathers in like piles. Oh, completed the bundle. Yay. Yep, we got some fall seeds. Um, Ooh. so all we we need a snow yam and a crocus for winter for the winter foraging bundle, and then the crafts room will be done. Hooray! Hooray! I'm just gonna go plant these fall seeds unfertilized because why not? It's kind of like leaving money on the table to not plant them, even though yes. they just spawn the forageables. It's like why not? You should anyway. Yeah. Why would you not? Karen, I'm gonna leave you some bait because you're the fisher. Okay. Or you have been. Yeah. No, that's fine. Well, however y'all want to do it. You can fish too. At some point, we'll all be everything because we'll all have the skills built up. Yes. Someday. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I don't I have the mods installed on this computer, so I'm not fishing at all. Oh, you're on the other computer today? <laughs> yes. I see. Yes. Works out great. Oh my goodness. I got a call from the school transportation department yesterday because I forgot. I'm very good about putting like east or west on my address. Mm -hmm. 
the one time I forgot was on the form to get Eliza on the bus next year. <gasps> no. And they called and they were like, hey, just checking. Are you here or here? And I'm like, oh, gosh, I'm so sorry. And my town is so small. <laughs> Did that and actually I'm like, It probably matters. doesn't matter. Apparently it does. Oh, God. Oh, man. Okay. Oops. It definitely Somebody matters have- here because we have we have areas where it's like the exact same street name within yep. the same zip code. And so you got to be really specific or things will go to the wrong place. Ugh. I'm just sitting here going, I don't want to drive two towns over to take my kid to school, please. Mm-hmm. Okay, I don't have my hoe to make more spots for, um, oh, for well. the fall seeds, but I planted a bunch of them. Okay, I was gonna say I can come out of bed and come hoe it up. Ha ha ha! Late night hoeing. Hey, the best kind, right? Oh my goodness. Okay, time to sleep. I was keeping your bed warm, Karen. Thank you. What a good bed warmer. We like to get cozy here on the farm. <laughs> I mean, it gets cold at night. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's right. Your progress has been saved. Yay. Ta-da. The kitty cat. <clears throat> oh, good. Yes. Rain today. Love that. Love it. I know you're busy on the farm. P.S. Love dad. Included some quality oh. stone. Quality stone. Thank Thanks, you, dad. dad. <laughs> oh, yes. Amethyst. Okay, Elliot, where, where are you at, my man? Got some oh. amethyst for you. I guess Tuesday cut the day that them. Marnie's not there. Yes. Yeah. Dang it. I was going to go buy a duck today because I think our barn is, um, I think our coop is upgraded. But it I is. We'll have, to do, we'll have to do that tomorrow. But I think this is probably going to be the last Stardew day that we play. I'll probably okay. be close to end of stream by the end of this one. We'll see. Um, but I bet. Yes, it is done. Okay. Oh, I got broken glasses. Annie's. Me. So something I didn't know about this game is if you have trees planted on your farm, like once a year, if you have a tree planted in a certain spot, it'll turn into a mushroom tree. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I didn't know that. And I started having mushroom trees pop up and I was like, what the oh, yep. hell? And you get more mushroom trees um, on the forest farm. Yes. I love mm -hmm. it so much. They're very cute. And you can tap them for mushrooms. Mm -hmm. It's really cool. I love that there's still things you can discover about this game because there's just so much content in it. Yes. It's all just little cute stuff. It's mm -hmm. not vital. It's not, oh, you're missing out on this huge thing. It's just cute. Yes, it is just cute. Exactly. It doesn't make you feel bad for missing it. Nope. That's one of the reasons why, like, when we first started this game, and I know, like, some of you guys had played it before, but some of you guys hadn't, I was like, you yeah. really can't mess it up. Like, there's really nothing you can do that, like, makes this game wrong or unplayable. This is not really a thing, you know? It's so nice. Mm -hmm. I wasn't convinced until... Yeah, neither was I. I knew. <laughs> and then you started playing it on your own, and you're like, oh, that's what that means. Yep. You can't mess... That's what can't mess it up means. I oh man because there's like there's nothing that you get locked out of like you can always do it later yeah mm -hmm. it's so cute yeah it's just a game full of easter eggs exactly low stakes I love low stakes mm -hmm. me too oops I don't need to be stressed out exactly I don't need a game to stress me out all right, I don't know what fish we need for the fall. I can't, I don't remember. Um, but I'm gonna, I'm fishing now. So we'll hopefully catch some more fish that we need for our bundles. Yay. Boop, boop, boop. Nothing's in there. What's in here? Okay. Beep, beep, beep. Yay. 
happily running around the farm like, oh, yes. <laughs> Everything is good. Oh, wait, I've got stone. I don't need stone in my pockets. That can go here. Thank you very much. Appreciate you, chest. I will need stone. But not today. I just saw a flying fish and that really scared me. Oh. <laughs> I saw Karen's fish come out. But you only saw the fish? Yes. <laughs> I was sitting here going, well, so, uh, you know, talking about things in Stardew that we've never seen before. I was going to say, I've never seen that. <laughs> but right when you said it, a frog jumped in front of me and I was like, oh, the, what's happening? Oh, man. Oh, yeah, the frogs will do that when it rains. It's very cute. It is very cute. It's just cute. All right. I, don't, I keep getting just smallmouth bass, which we don't need. I don't think this is a good spot. I'm going to relocate to the ocean. There's probably some ocean fish that we need. I bet there's ocean fish we need. <clears throat> if I make it that way, I'll go check. Oh, I got a cutscene. Oh, Ooh. sugar. I love that sugar is your stand-in. <laughs> it so reminds happy. me of my, my friend that was trying to stop saying God damn and she would say like, God bless it. <laughs> this is so <laughs> funny. <laughs> okay, so we got special notice board now. I don't know if it's gonna, if you guys Yay. are gonna see the cutscene or not, but we unlocked the special notice board. I know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Got that too. You got the cutscene? Mm hmm. Okay. Oops, stop. You're being so mean. Continue. Just to trying to mean. kill you. Oh, yeah, there we go. There's the cutscene. <laughs> Only trying to kill you. <laughs> What's the harm? Come on. It's normal stuff. Don't worry about it. Gosh. Don't be weird. I look forward to helping you. Couldn't get away. You just walked so into sorry. my cutscene. That's crazy. Oh no, Katie! I it cost us Katie money. Was knocked unconscious. The kitty is gone. Rip. Wah, wah, wah. I think since we were our, did I actually lose us some money, or were we too poor? Nope. <gasps> I just don't go down. Oops. No, and I lost the good sword. I <gasps> really screwed that day up. No. Oh no. That's a shame. Oh, as soon as I finished fighting the monster, I went to go eat my fruit and a bat appeared. Oh, and then it was rude. all done for you. Should have just stayed to the top of the mines. Okay, I'm so sorry. See. It's okay though. Shit happens. We'll recover. We need the lobster pot. Oh, oh, yeah, we probably need, need to make a crab pot. A red snapper. Okay. Where do red snappers spawn? I think ocean. Okay. Yeah, it's you... an ocean fish. Red snapper. Oh, we are, and we don't have a red snapper yet. Nope. Oh, okay. We need a tiger trout from the river. Oh, I see. We don't have a red snapper yet, and we don't have a walleye yet. I think walleye might be winter. Do you guys mind if I get a pirate sword? Oh no, go for it. Yeah, get okay. it. You've been doing a lot of work in the mines. You deserve a good sword. Yeah. Thanks. Three apples. Okay. Bump, bump, bump. Oh, I see another common mushroom. Yay. They're everywhere now. Yes. Oh, red snapper. That was easy. Okay. There we go. That's the I last one we need for the ocean bundle. Sweet. Oh, it might be too late now for the legendary fish. Did you already get Which... the fall legendary fish? No, I haven't caught any legendary fishes on this file. Okay. I usually wait until, like, I've leveled up my um, fishing before I worry about those. Because you only get the one, so it's like... And I also like you... to put them in the fish tank in my house, if I can get mm -hmm. that. All right, bundle complete.
Ta -da! We got some warp totems. Okay. I guess I should actually look at this. So we need the sandfish from the desert. We need the tiger trout from the river. We need a bunch of stuff from the crab pot bundle. If we just make a crab, we only need one more though. So if we just make a crab pot and put it somewhere, we'll get what we need. Yeah. And then walleye. I think wal walleye spawned maybe at night in the... Yeah, they're night um, fish. Walleye. I think they spawn in the winter though. But let me see. I can get any of these. Oh no, they small they spawn in fall and winter in rain. Hey. In the mountain Ten. lake. Your lucky day. Yeah. Nighttime rain in the mountain lake. So let's go do that. <clears throat> Ooh, the farm looks so beautiful. I know. It's so pretty in the fall. The fall has like nice soft colors, doesn't it? Yes. Even if you don't have your colors all modded like I do, the fall still looks pretty nice. Even if you're not fancy. Yeah. Get them mods on your on that computer, Kendra, so you can be fancy. I will. I'm just never on this computer. I understand. There we go. Someday. I was just looking at your chest. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <night bonk. laughs> it's okay. You're not the first. You're not going to be the last. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's... Oh. Wrong chest. Here we go. It, it's one thing to have to remember. I'm going to go plant the rest of these fall seeds. Good idea. And we've also got mixed seeds that we should probably plant too. Yeah. So we get fall crops from them. And then maybe oh, it'll ones. just, it'll have an eggplant and a yam for us so we won't have to go buy those yeah. seeds. Those are usually the ones that I save for the greenhouse so that I don't end up with the dead. Mm -hmm. The dead one, which is annoying. Okay. I right, just need five more spots. Oh my god, come to me, walleye. So many chubs. I don't <laughs> want no chubs. One of those days. Okay, now it's really dark. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is dark. Mm. When it's lighter Full in the cave. Uh -huh. Oh my goodness. I, so, Game of Thrones, for me, is a book that I have to listen to, not mm -hmm. read. Mm -hmm. And I've been listening to the audiobooks. I finally got around to getting into the last audiobook. But because of when I can listen to it, I'm always in bed. So I've started to like, oh, like, oh, I'm comfy, I'm warm. Someone's telling me a story. It's so great. Like, it's fantastic. Highly recommend. But when I start to get sleepy, I switch over to the first book just so I can, like, keep the voice going. Mm -hmm. And I'm still, like, in the first 10 chapters of the first book. And this narrator does not consistently say anyone's names in the first book. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting here going, hold on. We have Catelyn, we have Caitlin, we have a Catelyn. <laughs> and and they just don't going, pick? And they don't pick, like, they, they're stumbling for the first little bit. And I didn't notice it the first time I listened to it. That reminds me of Better Dick Cumberbatch saying penguin. Oh my goodness, <laughs> penguin. 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 I don't know. But I, I like the narrator. I think he does a great job. Um just can't do I do names. think that he pronounces certain things um in ways that aren't correct. That's funny. <laughs> but it, in the later books that is not a problem. Oh, he figures it's, it out. Yeah, they they nail it. It's just and I get it. Some of these names are you're so used to the regular version of these names. Yeah. <laughs> So I get it. Like it, 
I stumbled too. But it was just really jarring. I'm falling asleep and all of a sudden, it's just... Catalana. <laughs> no, hold on. Wait a minute. That's not what you said <laughs> five sentences ago. Uh, maybe maybe someday I'll read the Game of Thrones books if he ever fucking finishes them. I just, I have this like thought that they're just never going to be finished. And so I'm like, why would I start and put myself through that? I, there's it's so tragic he's living his best life though he doesn't he owe is. it to us oh even God. if we want it real bad life. um i saw you don't have a to tweet do it the other day like you know sometimes i feel bad but then i remember not even george r, r. martin used the pandemic to finish his novel <laughs> oh i saw that oh my yeah. god and i'm like you know what yeah that's true that's yeah. true it's okay to not be productive during oh, shoot, a time it's almost of 2 a.m. global upheaval. I know. I'm sitting here watching it. your screen. Like, what are it. you doing? I was I was organizing things and selling things. Okay, <laughs> right at the bell. Right at the bell. <laughs> Good job, you did it. You want to come on? Yeah. I am also doing an audio book, and there's four of them. And the first two had a great. Oh my god, you might be able to hear my washer. It's like going crazy. The <laughs> first two the lady that did it did such a great job with her voice and reading it and inflection. And yeah. then I guess I didn't want to pay her or she was busy. So for the third book, there's a oh, different no. voice person. Oh, and I, no. I hate it. <laughs> oh no. I hate oh. that. And it's like the official audiobooks they did that with. Yeah. Oh no. Oh man. It's fine. She's not bad. She's just not, it's, it's, it's like not, just the other one was, was better. Yes. And the other ones are what you started with and got familiar with. Mm -hmm. So it's fine. It's like getting to know a new person. All right. Well, that's the end of stream because it is only a couple minutes till stream end time. So get out of the farm, guys. We're exiting. Bye, farm. Bye, farm. It's okay. a good farm. It was a good farm. <clears throat> All right. I'm going to get the, an article up for us gonna say i saw an article the other day this week where uh somebody very prominent um in the news has lost 69 billion dollars this year what nice and i'm just like good <laughs> great oh my gosh that's what happens when you just spend all your time going into space <laughs> <laughs> i love that for him and for us okay so this is one this was one Landon found and I thought it was really appropriate, you know, to do something uplifting and positive in regards to our teachers, considering what's in the news yes. right now. So here we go. New Hometown Heroes Housing Program helps Florida teachers and first responders buy their first home. That's this amazing. is a statewide program. This is a statewide program that's starting over the summer for multiple critical professions. Like the article mentions teachers and first responders, but it's actually like over 50 um critical professions. And it's kind of like mm the people that you would expect to like need some extra assistance. So the article yeah. mentions um, firefighters, educators, law enforcement officers, healthcare professionals, childcare employees, and active military and veterans. All of those, um, you know, have different funding levels for their organizations, but not a single one of those people is actually paid good salaries in those professions. Yep. So you can see why. Um, so it's assistance with down payments and closing costs and um, they will also help you try to lower your mortgage rate for first-time home buyers. So here's a, here's a good quote that I liked. I've a, been a teacher for 25 years, says Melba Lugo, who works at the Mid-Cape Global Academy. I want to thank all these people that have made this possible. Owning a home seemed like such a distant, faraway dream. So after working for 25 years, uh, Miss Melba Lugo is finally going to get to own a home. I just, I love that. Mm -hmm. I want That's more amazing. stuff like this. I want yeah. more stuff like this. Like the way to solve the housing crisis, the way to solve homelessness, the way to solve these things is to just like mm -hmm. put people in homes, just yeah. put mm -hmm. them in houses. Like we it's literally them. that simple. Yep. And then they'll pass it down or upgrade. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. They'll take the equity from that house to buy a bigger one or they'll pass it down to like children or nieces or nephews or whoever, you know, um, in their family to build generational wealth. Like, yes, that's exactly what will happen. So I love this. So, so Florida, you did something right. Good job. Whoever worked on this and got it passed. 
Um, this is Florida. awesome. More states could do should do this. Yes. And it's oh, just so hard it. to even get a job or other necessary services if you don't have a permanent address. Right? Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. There, there's sort of a sad undertone that 25 years she didn't get to have a house. Yeah, yep. you shouldn't. There should be no job where you work it for 25 years and you still don't make enough for mm. to be able to mm-hmm. afford a mortgage. Like that yeah. should not happen. There should be no such mm. job where you have to work that long and you still can't afford a mortgage. Yes. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. All right, you guys, we're going to find someone to raid. We're going to find someone to raid. Um, so my friend to clarify that we've raided into a couple of times is doing a long 12 hour stream today. So I think we're oh, going to go yeah. ahead and raid into him. He's playing the forest right now. He's playing Ooh. the forest. Have you, are y'all familiar with that game? Oh, thank no, you so much for the magical. applause, Kitty. We'll let Landon know that yeah. happened so she can live another week. <laughs> yes. Give Landon. Perfect. So that's who we're going to raid into. Um, while I'm kind of getting that set up, uh, Kendra, if you could tell everybody where they can find you. Uh, you guys can find me at twitch.com, hopefully, fingers crossed, um, at Drowfeels, or you can go to onto Fields. Twitter, and it's the same username, twitter.com, slash Drowfeels, whatever it is, um, or I'm just goofy, silly goofy, usually, yes. hopefully. You can never find me. <laughs> <laughs> can never find you okay well then then kitty what would you like to promote as your closing <laughs> um i would like to promote that if you have an itch if you get mosquito bites this summer you slap it it really does work <laughs> it's true you know what also works to yeah. stop you from scratching it this stuff after bite i have some right here <laughs> oh <my goodness. laughs> yes yes that and slapping it, it after bites probably better than slapping it because i did feel a little bit like mark Wahlberg in fear walking around like <laughs> feeding my bites i can't believe it <laughs> but giving it a I'm little slap check. better than scratching it because then it doesn't spread around your skin and last longer mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. yep all right you can find me at all of the usual places here's all my socials um you can support me in all of the normal ways i do things just like every other twitch streamer does you guys know how that works um, Twitter is my main social media. So if you want to be the most up to date on what's going on with me and my schedule and things of that nature, that's where you want to check. You can also join my discord. The Discord's good for a couple of reasons. I control the pings in there. So you'll all, I'll always make sure that the pings go out. Um, I try to do a good job of that. So you don't have to rely on Twitch pinging you properly or YouTube pinging you properly or whatever. Um, and, uh, it's also an RP help server and you can also promote your own streams there. We have a channel for that as well if you are interested in doing any of that stuff. So um, let's see, we're good rating to clarify. Clarify, there we go. Okay, so um, next week, we are gonna be going back to our Sims 2 Pleasant View playthrough on Artistic License. So on Thursday, that's gonna be the stream. We're gonna be doing Sims 2 Pleasant View. We did our first stream of that like forever ago, like over a year ago, but we're going back to it. We're going back to Darren and his painting. And we're gonna play through more of the Pleasant View uh, homes, pre-made homes in that. And then next week on this show, we are back in Harry Potter land. We're going to do part one of our Half-Blood Prince stream. We're going to actually, oh now that now that Harry Potter in the sixth book is like proper YA, we're going to really go into how we feel about the way that the kids are treated in this book. So, um, so Harry Potter and all of the children is what we're going to be talking about for our part one. We're really excited. Mm-hmm. Yes. All right, you guys. That's it. That's all. Let's go into the clarify stream. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day. Bye. Bye. Bye.